we learned in the last year that there are three types of objects transparent translucent and opaque opaque objects especially those with a shiny surface like mirror perfectly reflect the light incident upon them we have studied the laws of reflection in the last year objects like glass and water are transparent because they allow the light to pass through them but does it pass without being affected in any way by these objects let us see let us do the activity 1 from the textbook take a transparent glass and fill it with water dip some portion of a pencil vertically in water and observe the thickness of the portion of the pencil in water now keep the pencil inclined to water surface and observe its thickness in both cases the portion of the pencil inside water appears to be thicker than the portion above water in the second case the pencil appears to be broken near surface of the water why does it happen let us now do the activity 2 from the textbook keep a 5 rupee coin in a metallic vessel slowly go away from the vessel stop at the place when the coin disappears now keep looking in the direction of the coin ask a friend to slowly fill water in the vessel you will be able to see the coin once the level of water reaches a certain height why does it happen in both the above activities the observed effects are created due to the change in the direction of light while coming out of water fill in the transparent glass halfway with water add some detol in it such that it becomes a bit hazy burn an incense stick insert it smoke inside the bottle now we have half water and half air in the glass both being a bit hazy make the room a bit dark and shine a laser from above such that it first passes through the smoke and then the water the purpose of making both the media hazy is so that we can see the full path of the light what do you see does the light pass through water unaffected certainly not the light ray changes its direction now shine the laser from below what do you see when it passes from water into the air yes it bends as the medium changes this phenomenon of bending of light due to the change of medium is called refraction this is responsible for distortion of images when seen through various types of lenses or glass objects that we are so familiar of let us now try adding oil into the bottle such that it forms three separate layers now when you shine the laser you will see that it bends at each boundary correct observe closely how the light ray bends at each of these intersections do you see any pattern let us come back to this in a later video